Peppers. Tis I the rumpled one. Oh man. I don't know if you guys follow the weather around the country, but Southwest Oregon got hit with snow about four or five inches a couple days ago. Well, out there it's rural, okay? People living in the country, some off the grid, some on the grid. Well, the people on the grid, power went out for 48, 72 hours. No power. Well, I was just talking to a friend, and they were telling me that some of their friends said that they, they lost all the food in the refrigerator and freezer. I want you to think about that. Snow, power went out, freezer, refrigerator. Huh. Um, do you see what's wrong with this picture? Snow! It's cold! You put snow in an ice chest. You don't have an ice chest? You got a trash can? You got some plastic bags? Put snow in the plastic bags, in the ice, in the uh, trash can. Put your food in there. Pack it in snow. It'll keep it cold! I mean, <laughs> you gotta admit, that's pretty dang funny. I, I, I mean, come on. Now, I could see if maybe if they had a heat wave and it knocked down the electric grid that you lose your food. But, you get hit with snow and you lose your food? Come on! Put two and two together. I mean, you see, preppers, this is the kind of stuff that you're preparing for, right? Now, be honest, how many of you would have lost your food? Hopefully none. But if you would have lost your food, let these other pe let let this example teach you a lesson. Okay? <laughs> but you know, I, I'm not really laughing at their misery. I, I'm just laughing at the situation because you know it's kind of like. Uh, that story where you have an aquarium and you have fish in the aquarium and there's food on one side and then you put this glass so the fish you know they can't get to the food then you remove the glass well they say they, they quit trying but that might not be the best analogy but it to me it's it's still funny it, it's what they need to survive is right there in front of them and they don't use it. So that just goes to show people if you fail to prepare, you're preparing to fail.